Hello, I'm Matt Guff from TheHouse.com and this is a 2019 Burton Ruler Leather Snowboard Boot designed for all mountain freestyle use for beginner to advanced level riders that want the premium quality in their snowboard boots. Um, the ruler has been within the line for you know, 20 plus years. Uh, they actually have quite a few different styles of ruler boots within the collection from lace options, of course, to wide versions. Um, but overall, it has a medium style flex. A lot of people like this. You can be an exclusive free rider or you can be an exclusive park rider and you can love the rulers. But this leather version, um, compared to some of the other ones, has a uh, suede style leather. So the underside of the leather is actually on the outside of this boot is water resistant, of course, and it'll gradually break in over time, kind of like and hold its shaping that your foot and binding gives it. It's like breaking in a baseball glove. Like the more you use it, the more it's gonna kind of mold around to whatever shape is inside and outside and how it reacts to the elements around it. Uh, of course, the, the upper shell, yeah, again, is suede. It has more support style panels. Um, it doesn't feature the grip light backstay like the other ruler options. It's, this is all suede, of course, but the, the backstay is a little bit taller, a little bit more supportive than what you'll find in the rampant, the moto, and of course, the invader. There's flex style notches in that instep, so this allows for the boot to flex over the top of the toe side edge without a lot of material pinching directly underneath your, your ankle strap. Uh, there's a 3D molded kind of power up medium flex style tongue that actually has a little bit of rebound to it, so you flex it out, it's gonna kind of want to go back to the same kind of shape that it's designed in. And then there's a lot of other stuff going on underneath your foot. Uh, the first thing is like that sleeping, bla sleeping bag reflective foil. It's kind of a, it's kind of a piece of tin foil almost that kind of reflects heat uh, back towards your body. And then there's B3 gel in that EST uh, outsole. This EST outsole is actually really thin and allows the board, uh, the boot to give, uh, feel the board out a lot more. Uh, there is rubber in those high wear areas, but for the most part, um, this is a, a lot of EST style foam. So it's, it's actually really lightweight. Um, you know, the tread isn't too big and again, um, if you ride an EST style binding or any kind of binding out there, uh, you're gonna get a lot better board feel and snow feel with that kind of thin style uh, footbed. Uh, also inside is that locked up style cuff, an integrated liner lacing system that features a, a locking liner uh, lace. And then there's this thing. This is the imprint two. Uh, it's kind of a, a step up from the imprint one, of course. There's external kind of J-bars that you see here that work well with uh, the internal J-bars. I'd wrap around your heel for better heel support. There's double Velcro on the tongue to kind of keep it centered. And then of course a, um, a plush style man for up on top. And you know, despite the, the boot having kind of like a medium flex, um, it's still going to be pretty darn comfortable, especially along that backside. Um, the shell of the boot actually kind of has a little bit softer section. The support panels kind of have this like little U-shaped U -shaped style cutout, so you don't get that high back bite. And that's kind of like the same thing with the upper zone of the Imprint 2 um, liner. But lastly, inside of this thing is this uh, footbed. It's pretty simple. It has a little bit harder of a like durometer rating, there's a little bit of arch support, heel cradle, perforations for breathability, and then a, a kind of a plush top that is moisture wickening. Uh, this is a great boot overall that features you know, shrinkage footprint reduction technology. This size 11 actually leaves a size 10 imprint on the snow. So anyone out there with big feet, you're gonna love this thing. It has a convenience of speed zone lacing systems with a New England style rope so you can separate the upper and lower sections. Yeah, overall, it's awesome and it features suede. Make sure to check this thing out at thehouse.com. Leave a comment or question, let me know what you think of this thing here. Subscribe to the channel there, check out more vids there, and hopefully I'll see you on snow. Peace.